Let me tell you, whenever you haven't showered for a few days, ah! <laughs> I feel like this spot is so special. We found an incredible boondocking spot and we're right outside of Zion National Park. We found it on I long to see you when the day is done. I wanna rest in now we've been to Zion before, so we weren't super inclined to go back in. Plus, I think our rig is too tall. There's a tunnel that actually goes through Zion from what I recall, and I think it was only like 11 feet. Anyone correct me on this down in the comments. Let me know about that tunnel in Zion. We just wanted to have some downtime, honestly. We wanted to relax. We wanted to have good service so we could upload a video. Today, we're gonna be hitting the road again, and we're going to be trying to go to Lake Powell. We've never been to Lake Powell. We want a body of water to be able to camp at right nearby. Let's go. pretty darn game-changing for our off-grid setup and this is a Camp Lux instant hot water heater so we can take showers on the go this is gonna be our go-to outdoor shower setup for whenever we're in beautiful places like this thank you so much to Camp Lux for sending us this instant hot water heater uh, we're gonna test it out right now I'm gonna show you all basically how it's connected how easy it is to use. I also want to show you this add-on that we got to go with the Camp Lux. It's a Camp Lux product and it's a 12 volt pump setup. So that means that whenever we don't have a water hookup, we're still able to use this as long as we have water. Basically, we can hang up this Camp Lux wherever we go. What we're gonna do just to make it easy on us is hang it from our RV ladder because we do need propane and we always have our propane tank on our hitch carrier on the back. So cool, this is so cool. This is the 12 volt adventure kit basically. So this is a pump right here. We're gonna be able to drop one of these hoses right into our water jug. This is gonna provide pressure to the hot water heater and it'll come out of the shower head and we'll be taking a shower. What makes it really easy to use the Camp Lux instant hot water heater is that there's all these quick connects. So basically you just snap it in place and you're ready to run hot water. Now we're gonna plug in the 12 volt pump to our Blue Eddy power bank. Now this thing uses so little power and it lasts for so long. And the last step is to install the shower heads. Red indicates hot, very easy to know what all these parts are for. Okay, cool. Let's take a shower. <laughs> Not just a shower, a warm shower. That's the whole thing about out here. You know, you can always throw a gallon of water on your head and you know, if it's really hot outside, it'll feel good. But a warm shower when you're boondocking, nothing like it. We're using biodegradable soap just to be environmentally friendly. Bam. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's perfect. Let's try it out. We're gonna fire it up. <laughs> Let's see. It's coming out. Go. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Thank you. I want that water waste. It feels so good. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Wow! <laughs> the only thing is we're limited on water. We have five gallons. <laughs> really good water pressure too. It really is. It's perfect. Oh my god. You can adjust the gas amount, so the heat level, and you can also adjust the water pressure too. So if you're trying to conserve water, you can turn it down a little bit. In this case, we're trying to conserve water. It was really easy to get it going, and this whole unit is incredibly affordable. Gotta get my pits. We hardly used any water. I think next time I'd take a little longer of a shower, but you know, we gotta wear our swimsuits like because of all this. Out. 
Hey. All the, she doesn't want to get out. She's staying in the shower. There's still, there's still like three gallons of water. We have a, like a six gallon jug, so there's still half of the water. I've been really excited to add the Camp Lux to our off-grid setup. I really wanted to see how long it would take me to like set this whole thing up. Put it all together in like two minutes. It's very simple. Seems like there's kind of a lot of parts to it, but there's really not, honestly. There are a lot of parts with this shower, but once you practice a few times, it gets way easier. 